Peak Latino America Tour is in full swing this week. We're at the Mundo Mayo Open presented by Heineken. Remember, the sponsor last week was Stella Artois, so we have a very thirsty group on the NEC Series Latino America Tour. Starting off on the 17th, it's Juan Lizarralde sitting at two over at this point. He started off the day with a double bogey, then eight straight pars on the front. Comes in to the 17th at two over, but sticks his tee shot here. We're going to tap in for birdie to finish at one over. Good enough for a tie for 46. Zach Blair now also sitting at two over at this point. He started on the back nine. Coming off birdie on five. He drains that one to also finish at one over. Then we'll head over to the fourth. It's Mauricio Azcu, seemingly always in contention. He started on the back as well. Remember, he's sitting seventh on the money list currently, fighting for one of those top five spots at the end of the season will turn into full web.com tour cards. This for birdie to get to two under par. And that's where he would finish his day. He's sitting in a tie for 11. Over now to the eighth, it's Rodolfo Casbon. He plays first at Q School this year to gain full status. And since then, he's notched two top 25 finishes in three starts. So taking advantage of his full stats on Latino America tour. This to get to five under par, which would be good enough for a share of the lead, but he would go on to finish at four under after dropping one. That's just one off the lead though after 18 holes. Over to the ninth, it's Tommy Cocha from Argentina. He actually won this event back in 2012, so it should be no surprise to see him at the top of the leaderboard, sitting at four under at this point. This is his last hole of the day, his second shot on the ninth, as he leaves himself about three feet here for birdie and to grab a share of the lead. Kocha looking to win this event for the second time in two years and a solid start well on his way to maybe getting that done, finishing at five under par, tied with this guy. Chris Meyer, this to get to five under par, grab a share of the lead. He has conditional status on Latino America Tour, so a strong finish this week would go a long way. He's tied with Kocha and Michael Budacavalli.